invocation by Srimati Shiji. Academy and Senior Fellowship of the Ministry of Culture of Government of India. 
and the Nehru Fellowship of his academic research work. He is a recipient of Academy Fellowship of the Kerala Lalita Kala Academy. He has widely traveled and is familiar with national and international art exhibitions and art practices. So we are blessed to have your presence here. I would like you to please come and speak a few words. Thank the organizers, Sukhdeshta, for having invited me for this evening's function. And uh, it's always a pleasure to be in a function where Kaveri performance is going to be seen. And being a chief guest, there's no advantage, I can sit in the front line. <coughs> the greatest contribution of Kerala to the classical performance of Arkuri Artham, Kathagani, and Krishna Artham, Nanyarupa, and Mohini Artham. But the greatest contribution to the music world are percussion instruments. That is, Kedakka, Timila, Modalam, Chanda, and Miram, which is normally used to work Puriyatam and Chatyarvata. The Chanda is also called, I don't know how many of you know, is Asuravadya. But you will know why it is so special on the music instrument. Panjavadya, Ayamdura and Pandimayana, these are exclusive to Kerala. There are something very special about the Kerala culture. And uh, other related performances uh, are always appreciated, and it is exclusive to them. <coughs> the accumulated artistic investment of Kerala has really enriched, and it is uh, that investment which has given most of this present day generation uh, to express their creativity. I, as a uh, practicing artist, uh, take the interest of this accumulated artistic investment uh, uh, from Kerala uh, resources and do my creative work. And these performers who are actually going to do performances here today are the last link or the recent link of a tradition which has started several hundred years ago. Over the years, I have been doing research on ritual art performances of Kerala, but long before that, during 1960s and 70s, almost every year, I went to the Central Kerala and seen Kadagali, at least about 20 full night Kadagali every year. And during that particular season or particular period, I might have seen all the great performers taken one door or another and uh, I used to go in the same bus of Kalamandaram and uh, come back in the early morning after the performance. And same way I used to attend the annual festival of Kotak Nagwe Deshala and uh, see the full three days or four days of uh, full day performances. So these were actually my diagram. And the Kadhavari has some special characters. It is not meant for ignorant innocence. It is meant for people who have some cultivated taste. Or it is meant for everybody, but who has some cultivated taste or aesthetic principle can appreciate Kadhavari better than, say, normally uninitiated people. Here, <coughs> uh, actually in the Kadhavari there are many compositions. Uh, to my knowledge or my information, there are over 50 compositions in uh, uh, stories of Kadagala, 
Kadiradi, all of them are based on uh, Puranas or uh, Ramayana or Mahabharata or Bhagavad Purana. And there are 15 conversations in Mahabharata and about 7 conversations, only 7 conversations in Ramayana and about 16 or 17 conversations in the Bhagavad Purana. And, uh, uh, but there are some miscellaneous sections where during the period of nearly about 10 to 30 years ago, they did some experiment in bringing out Kadirani version of Sora and Rastal, Pinlia, Magdana Mariam, and Midsummer Night's Dream, etc. And uh, during the 70s, if I remember correctly, or the 60s, uh, N.V. Krishnavarya wrote a Buddha Jaridam, which was uh, at that time the interest in Kadirani composition. But later, Mali, Mali Madhav, Madhav Maya wrote a composition, Karma Chapadam, which is supposed to be one of the finest composition because that is the first composition where Malayalam is a given more uh, strength. Earlier versions almost always were uh, Sanskrit dominated Malayalam. But Mali Madhav, uh, Madhav Maya's Karma Chapadam is a really chaste Malayalam composition. And that's a very good composition too. Gobiyasan usually take the role of karma in Karma Chapadam. Then later, there are many other, uh, there are some special characteristics in Kadirani. Kadirani, actually, you know, there is an important role, most important person in Kadagadi or character in Kadagadi to uh, take the right side position. But when it comes to an important person in the role, like for example in Kalyana Sabadhyam, when Bhima actually recognized that uh, uh, Hanuman was like his half stepbrother, or half brother, or stepbrother, eldest stepbrother, he suddenly realizes that uh, he, all his anger and all his uh, arrogance has vanished and that she gives the important role and move aside from the left side of the stage and give the position to Anuma. And this particular scene is so beautiful in Kadagadi. These are many things like that. For example, when important character like late women take to the role or uh, play the role, Chanda is not used. Only Madhavan is used. I hope one day this uh, Uthishta would give a demonstration earlier on the forenoon of the performing day and give some uh, guidance or information to the performer and his audience so that they can appreciate uh, the journey. And I take this opportunity to uh, be thankful for giving me this opportunity uh, chances and uh, Thank you for coming and enjoy the chapter. Thank you so much, sir, for those wonderful words. Can we please